Hi everyone, my name is Morgan Flowers. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video today and tuning into another week with me. If you're new here, hey boo. If you're not new here, hey boo. <laughs> um, I actually have to work today, so um, I did have my little breakfast, my little iced coffee, all that good stuff this morning. And um, I'm just going to be chilling today. I have some work to do. Um, what else do I have to do today? Hmm, we're going to see. Okay, let's go. <laughs> So I wanted to talk a little bit about like my plan for my business. Um, I kind of wanted to rebrand re the Vision Workshop. Um, so right now I'm talking to some company, well, a company about um, like new lip gloss tubes and like getting them printed with my label on it. Um, so I kind of was up last night just redoing my label, just trying to do it myself. I did pay to have it done, but it was just okay. Like I feel like I might have, I may have settled for it. Like, I had a vision in my mind, this is why the vision workshop, I had a vision in my mind of how I wanted it to go, how I wanted it to be, and it just didn't get, it, it didn't, it, it was, not saying, I don't want to say it wasn't executed right because it wasn't the girl's fault, like, I just had a vision for it and I thought I was going to like it, but I really, like, kind of didn't. But I was kind of rolling with it because it was something that I paid for. It was something that um, I wasn't trying to be too particular. Well, not saying I wasn't going to be too particular about my business. But I wasn't being picky because I thought that's what I wanted. You know, I thought I thought that's what I wanted and that's just how it came out. But I was like, you know what? I kind of just want to redo it and maybe I can do it myself. That's something that I've been kind of huge on lately. Trying to do stuff myself. Like I showed you guys me doing my own like Vlogmas intro. I was trying to now don't get me wrong I will pay somebody for their service like I'm not against that at all if it's something that I want specifically done I will pay somebody for it but some things you know I don't mind trying myself um, so that's kind of what that's been my goal lately so I'm like you know what let me just try to figure out play with some fonts play with some designs and see if I can make my own logo for the vision workshop um, so that's what I was doing last night and I kind of sent it over to a brand to see what it would look like on a lip gloss tube and um, I, my plan is by January just try to like redo it all um, I'm probably gonna redo my website um, I'm gonna well I am gonna redo my website um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna retake any pictures because if you guys have ever looked at my website those pictures I had taken by my girl Shabria um, so that was cool but I probably won't do that again I'm not sure um, I'm not sure how I will incorporate those same pictures or if I should like have a photo shoot for the vision workshop again um, but that's kind of what I've been up to um, and I was thinking like pre panty pre pandemic like I love making lip gloss like I love creating stuff I love creating and making new colors and seeing like what I come up with and just incorporating different smells and different tubes like I love doing that it was like very therapeutic for me like you know you ever have something that's like you just love doing it just because you just love doing it like it's just it's pleasing in a way um that's kind of what lip gloss making was to me um but of course after the pandemic I was getting sales and stuff but it kind of really starts to slow down and I realized that a part of it was probably me I'm sure it was me because I wasn't pushing it as much as I should and as much as um, a brand owner should be pushing their business. So um, I do want to go into the new year with a new slate for the vision workshop and just trying to um, do something cute and just give it a little boost. So that's been my goal. One of my goals lately, I guess, juggling a bunch of things at once. That's That's been something that I've been trying to do and trying to figure out. So... That is a January 2021, 2021, 2022 goal. <laughs> um, so definitely be on the lookout for that. I kind of, um, I've been brainstorming here and there. It's so many things that I'm like trying to lock in on at the moment. So um, it's coming along, <laughs> basically. I'm a
everyone happy turkey day it is um thursday i actually just got dressed i just threw on this little zip up top and like a pair of zara jeans um i'm gonna be heading to my aunt shortly i'm just finishing up the yams i wanted to kind of like reheat them a little bit um taste them <laughs> and then i'm gonna be heading out short shortly i'm all stuttering but we're supposed to be meeting at five it's 4 30 now so i'm like 
right on time if i can leave out in like 10 15 minutes um y'all know how black people be chat we don't even be on time but <laughs> i can try to be on time for today um um i did have to work this morning so you know i'm happy to be off of course and then i can kind of spend the rest of my day with my family i'm going to try and go to my best friend's house and see what she's doing um and then we're going to go from there um yeah i'm not gonna yeah i'm gonna vlog at my family's house of course and um give y'all the vibes hopefully we're eating good um it's just gonna be a couple of us like i, I just saw this sweet what well, was a post on instagram it's about like how some people have like 50 cousins and stuff and then there's other people's families who just got like three the three family cousin three cousin family is me okay i don't have a big family at all like it's just gonna be a couple of us i mean my family is separated this year i don't know if it's due to covid people just had different stuff going on like my cousin who usually comes him and his family they were going um my little cousin plays volleyball at, at like she plays volleyball somewhere oh my gosh time is flying i don't know if she's a freshman in college but she plays volleyball so he was going to see her so they weren't like doing the family thing this year and then my other aunt she just came back from a cruise so she was like they wasn't really planning for thanksgiving nobody really talked about it like i feel like families we just started talking about where thanksgiving was going to be like no one had this figured out like as opposed to other years where you've been talking about this it's going to be at grandma's house or it's going to be at auntie's house um but we just kind of figured it out like early november so um it's just going to be a couple of us and i guess it's okay as long as i get some food and i'm and like i said i usually go over to my best friend's house and go to her i go to her grandma's house so if they're cooking and stuff i'll definitely stop by and yeah go from there i do have to work in the morning so i don't want to be out too late tonight but um I'm still gonna try and see my peoples and let's go. Y'all, let me tell you, okay? Before I leave out, I just kinda like put the foil and everything on the yams, but a moment of like, <laughs> just a moment of transparency because as many times as I make the yams for myself, like at home, as a side, you know, just when I'm cooking randomly, they be so good. Why was I struggling? Like, like, Every time I tasted it, it just did not taste that good. It didn't taste as good as I'm used to them tasting. Like, I was just so confused. I mean, the one thing that I did switch is the syrup. Like, I know some people add, like, um, they add brown sugar, regular sugar, vanilla extract, and, you know, uh, cinnamon, and all that good stuff. And that's, and butter, you know, stuff like that. But sometimes I'll add a little bit of syrup to give it more of that consistency. But I switched my syrup. But that shouldn't have not, it just wasn't sweet enough. Like, that's really what it was. I don't know if it's the pressure, like, if it's a mental thing. Like, maybe I'm thinking too hard. Maybe I'm just, like, thinking, like, oh, my gosh, I'm cooking for the family this year. Like, this this girl that I follow tweeted, and she was saying, like, um, you know you an adult when they ask you to start cooking and bringing food. Like, before, we're so used to just coming. Hey, y'all. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> now I'm cooking. Like, now y'all got me. Y'all signing I got my I got a dish now <laughs> when I didn't have a dish any other year so I'm like okay maybe it's the pressure but I was struggling trying to get it to taste up to par like I like mine a little bit on the sweet side just, just a little bit just a little bit but I felt like it just wasn't that sweet and I was just getting really frustrated mind you I started this last I started making this yesterday but I finished it today because I had to work and da da da, da. so I was just like why am I struggling right now I'm just gonna show you guys what they look like. What I did is I just mixed it. I made fresh put I made fresh yams. I just cut them up like you guys saw. But when I got back here today, I added a can of like canned yams. Um just to see if the canned yams made any of a difference um as far as the sweetness, as far as anything like that. I've never made canned yams before. I always cut them up and make them like that. So honestly they they didn't make that much of a difference. I probably could have kept them out. But um <laughs> I'm still gonna show you guys how they turned out when we get there um like i said it's not that big of a family event like it's only literally going to be a couple of us like my little cousins and my grandma and my aunt. like that's literally all it is so it's not like a huge dinner it's just very intimate very chill um so that's why i only made this like one little pan i probably bring some back home which is cool with me because i will always just make something else to go with it and put it on the side okay um but it's literally i'm late okay bye Oh, did she? She did say that. I mean, but they eat, and I mean, it's up to you guys if you want to start eating now. I'm fine. Yeah, you can eat something now. Because, yeah, definitely. Like this, but on like a blue and silver. It says Rita's, not Rita's anymore. 
It's officially yours. I got stuff. Oh, you know, we got to look at those uh, pictures. Oh, yeah. Yes. So I'll let you. We'll, we'll, we'll look at that, too. Oh, so you cooked everything? Not cooked. everything. Oh, I just okay. got the greens and, and I did the turkey. Are you a turkey okay. person? I do like turkey. Uh, I'm not really a turkey person. This is strictly about you being traditional. Yeah. So it's stuffing, turkey and stuffing. It's gravy. Grandma made the rice. And mac, she made some mac and cheese, girl. Yay. Like, what's your favorite? Like, right, right. But you have to have that. What is it? You have to have mac and cheese and hymns. <laughs> Together in a combination? Yes. Interesting. And you also have to have stuffing. Mac That's and cheese and what? I thought, you, I thought what? you was a stuffing person. Yams. I love stuffing. Mac and cheese and what? And yams. Together. Oh, okay. Laura, you mix them? Huh? What? You mix them together? Mac and cheese and yams? <laughs> you said mix them. I eat them. <laughs> you know, like, don't mix You're like, them mix. Yeah, I, I, I remember one time, together. it was one year, I was at Tyra's house and we literally got a plate and just had mac and cheese and yeah, like both of just ate. <laughs> Morgan likes cheesecake. I sure did. Yeah. <laughs> you can take, can take one of each or? No, but you I gotta know to, um, which it is though, cause you don't, you, are you gonna drink it now? No, what do you mean I gotta know? It's mango. Oh, I thought I was gonna give you a baggie, but you wouldn't have known which each the one flavor. Was. You just kind of oh, threw it in there. No, I'm just gonna get this one. No, no, no. <laughs> my bad. Are we in it? Am I yeah, in it? Yeah, it's, it's pepper. Can you get a little closer to your brother? You see that space in the middle of the couch? Yeah, but does pepper look good too? Yes, yeah, pepper looks Yikes. great. Yeah, I think I'll take care. I might turn that light off in back of Morgan. Let me see how this. What do you think? You think um, I should? Oh, I'm thinking. Let's do another one. Did you get a sparkle in my eye? Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Flash. It might collapse. It might flash, but maybe not. It might. Let me see. Pepper, look at you. Ah, that, that, that. Would you stop it? All right, I'm done with y'all. All of you. I was ready. All of you. All right, come on, ready? I think that was a good one. Let me see, child. <laughs> no, no. Look, everyone's candy big enough. Put them in your room. Come on, Pepper. <laughs> If come you on. don't get that rabbit out of off my pepper, carpet, come on. Get pepper, pepper, come on. Pepper, pepper, pepper. pepper, 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 pepper. See, pepper. Oh, this is hey. what the rest of that, the house No, pepper's more that is welcome. <laughs> come on, this is what the rest of the house Pepper take up around. enough of my house. Looking around. He's in, this is yeah. what it looks pepper. like in here. Pepper take up enough Hi, of pepper. my house. All right, Pepper, see you. you. See you Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. Pick up the rabbit, Gabby. Put them in your room. Put her, it, in your room. She don't bite my toes, room. Pepper. Pepper, don't bite my toes. Pepper, I feed you. Y'all. Crazy. I'm not in any This is my invitation for when I was babysitting. They're baby children. Look, like, it's the cheeks for me. Is it? What'd you say? The key department that y'all lived in, that's where you met? Oh, yeah, I wasn't know. I think yeah, so. and I don't remember. I told you, I'm gonna, these are really for her to. to <laughs> Taylor. No, the jewelry places. Snapping and oh, grabbing. They have these big gangs and they go in and they snatch up everything and then they all run out the door and go in all kinds of different ways. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Natural tea, making natural. Oh, okay, I'm natural. <laughs> so there is a. Where is it at? Yeah, he'll eat it. He won't smash it. You want applesauce? Alright, there's one on here that's like. You pick until you get that color, and I'm trying to find the card. Just, just take the sheet and stuff and put it over the couch at least. Yeah. I mean, whatever. <laughs> Let her know what she feels. Alright. Wait, are we playing on the right side? Yes. Oh. I don't know what's going on. I can't take this. It's Uno. <laughs> it was this, it was this one part where... Yo, somebody want to eat some, some cake Yo. with me right now? What cake? The baby one cake. Can we bust one open? <laughs> what? Can we bust one open now and share it? What is it? This cake. Oh. All right. We got a thousand in there. Can somebody share one with me? We need a dishwasher. <laughs> they definitely do. Bye, because when we had one, you said... We need a kid to do all this. She plucked. She plucked. Oh, 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 sorry. Is it? Is you? Okay. No, it's me. No, it's you. We're going to school now. Oh, it's me? Uh, okay. <laughs> Which way is it? Is it my turn? Yeah. Oh. Excuse me. 
Flip him up. Oh, so you got to flip him over. Mm -hmm. For this one. With the confetti. Who turned into this one? It's it flip. No. It's flip. I thought she had to flip. Oh, I'm sorry. Here you go. No, we all flip. So it's this color. Yes. No, but I thought. We all flip. Who threw down a flip? So I throw it down. Then it down. Then it's your turn. Oh, so it's both. You throw it down. Then flip it. So now it's purple. Oh, okay. So this is not it. Oh, wait. I'm sorry. Vic, you made it. No. You got to flip it. What kind of color do you make? Sweet potato. That's okay. your carrot cake? Yeah. I'm getting that tomorrow. T, I need a piece of that for tomorrow. Draw it until you get an orange. <laughs> so oh, gosh. Who, Tyra? Yeah. You gotta I don't do sweet potatoes orange. at all, you know but I make a carrot it, cake. It better be orange. Bangers. How come you don't oh, like sweet potatoes? I don't like sweet potatoes at all. Nothing's no yeah. I don't even like pumpkin. You really? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I really was about to hit Uno. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. Oh my god. Oh, oh, <laughs> alright, alright. Alright, wait. It's, it's orange. <laughs> the baby or sis? That so, no, baby. so no, sis you can pick cute. whoever you want to go. So sticking cute though. Wait, so I can do what? You can pick whoever you want to go. Oh, so it doesn't yeah. have to. Yeah. For I don't know. So it's like, wow. It's like, it's like crazy act. Uno after dark. I don't know. Our time to go. Okay. I'm about to say, I don't know. So then it better just go that way, that is. I see. How's he doing with, um, how's he doing with his other stuff? Oh, Trying to switch jobs. Wait a hey, minute. Hey, Hold on. Hey. Um, so long, what does that mean? She test. never said Uno. He has to go testing for Get that too. Oh. <laughs> he got to do a test for Uno. No, no. Yeah, I did. I did. No, uh, that's all right. No, that's not no. the thing. Okay. Just the what? test. Okay, good. But I guess that's the one with the top. Vic, you can take this one. I just knew this was going to happen. Yo. You can take this one. You out of pocket. See, I'm going to give you this one with the lid. Okay. With the turn. All right. All right, this thing got Yes. Coquito, I know. Use this one. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Your turn. Yo, I can't. All right, that's cool. We making it come back. Oh no! Oh ah! Uh -huh. The courts get. <laughs> okay. Yeah. He told me to take a bite. Tyra, bottom, right? oh, you got you, Tyra. Yeah. Right. How much you got? I don't know. Yes. All right. Yes. Oh, can we pay for extra? Jeremy, can we pay for extra? I ain't paying for it. No, I'm saying that people say this one. Yeah. What the heck? See here. You know what? Uh, right. Extra one, just in case. All right. All right. Say hi to the camera. That one though, because those that I can do it on. Grocery style. <laughs> Hey guys, um, it is later in the evening. It is Thanksgiving evening. I do have to work in the morning, so I'm really ready to take it down. I'm really ready to take it down. Um, very tired, just very exhausted. When you guys saw me cooking the, the yams, that was yesterday. Well, I'm, I'm pretty sure I put the date at this point. So that was yesterday. And um, I'm so tired. Like, I'm so tired. It's not even 10 o'clock yet. Well, it is 10 o'clock, actually. Um, so I'm going to be headed to bed soon, but I kind of wanted to talk about um, just the day as a whole. What my family does for every Thanksgiving, we, like, go around and say, like, what we're thankful for. Like, I'm not sure if your families do the same thing, but um, one of the things that I mentioned was just, like, me being thankful for just family in general and just like how we can still get together and still meet even though we're small like it was literally just a couple of us um all of my family kind of decided to do different things this this year um one of my aunts she went on a cruise so she wasn't really pressed about they just came back from the cruise so the last thing not the last thing on her mind but it was just kind of like a, it wasn't a priority to see like okay what what they were doing for thanksgiving and like cooking coming right back home to cook and prepare you know so um they just did something small in their own home my other cousin had like a volleyball i think I, did i explain this already i think i did i feel like i explained this already or maybe i was thinking about saying it but anyway Everyone was just kind of all over it, all at their own homes. My aunt that we usually, we meet up with my aunt and my uncle as well. But they um, they alternate years. Like every every other year they'll go to one side of the family and then the other side of the family. So this is their year to go to the, uh, to the other side of the family. So everyone just kind of did their own thing. And it was just a couple of us, um, just really the immediate family. Um, unfortunately, my dad had to work. So he couldn't make it. Um, my sister was with her family. So it was just like... You know, it's just a small little group of us. And it's just appreciating those little moments and, like, cherishing them almost, you know. We were sitting there talking about, like, what we would do as a family. I'm like, let's fam let's plan a family trip. Like, let's do something. You know, it was always something that we did growing up. We always went to the Poconos or 
um like these pictures that i got i was gonna kind of i did kind of show you guys some of the pictures that i got um these are like from my aunt because she was saying that she had a bunch of pictures of me things that i just haven't seen yet and that's always so cool to me too like it's so much that i haven't seen of my younger self and i just be looking at it like yeah like oh that's little morgan like that was like i remember that moment or i remember that me doing that like when i was in dance class i used to have like a dance class or whatever um and I'm not going to show you guys the pictures now because they're so, it's, it's dark in here. Like, you guys can't really see this too much. Like, that's me, like, over here. But I had, like, my little dance, my little dance outfit on. But, like, I remember these moments and I just have all these pictures. <laughs> so I'm going to add them to my little photo book that I mentioned, like, vlogs ago. Um, this photo book that I was trying to do. Um, but it just really makes me look like, this is little me. Like, I love her. <laughs> look at my cheeks like that is crazy like my cheeks are like <laughs> um but just really like cherishing those little moments with your family um <clears throat> and um just genuinely being thankful for the little time that you have with the people that you love so um that was cool and then i went to my best friend's house i always go to her grandma's house every year um so you guys saw um we were just we were playing uno um i had um i didn't eat there because i should have took a plate honestly i didn't eat there they always got some good food at top child okay um but i ate at my aunt's house so it's like i wasn't really hungry oh shoot i just remember my food that i brought home from my aunt's house is sitting on my counter so i should probably put that in the fridge <laughs> because my car was rocking i don't know if y'all ever left food in y'all car or like oh my gosh i hate stuff like that <laughs> My car smells like food. Uh, even if you love the food, it can be your favorite meal that you bring home. But that lingering smell of food, like it stinks so bad. I'm just like, oh my gosh, I should open, I should crack a window. But I wouldn't want to leave it like that overnight, of course. So, um, I'm just gonna wind down for the rest of the night. Wait, because this picture is hilarious. <laughs> look at me. First of all, I look like a little boy. <laughs> I look like a little boy. I'm just like. <laughs> Uh, that picture made me laugh that picture made me laugh okay um so tomorrow like i said i have to work i'm gonna try to i need to get some content pictures if we're being completely honest i really need to get some content pictures so i'll probably try and go and take some pictures um to at least tomorrow or saturday i really need to make saturday a content day like oh that's what i was going to talk about guys i was going to say like just a shift in mindset because i feel like once i start considering like uh youtube as work it just becomes a whole shift it's just a whole shift like you see the bigger creators and the bigger content creators they say like i have to work later and by work they mean editing and filming and planning um that's what i kind of need to do because then you then i start thinking of it more so as a sorry y'all i'm just like collecting all the pictures together but then i start to think of it more so as a second job like as a part-time job because it really is essentially is you know i do essentially want this to um I want my channel to grow i mean it's not like i said it's just a part-time i still have my nine to five but um i'm just like i'm just noticing just a difference like once i say i need to work then i need to dedicate like a day to actually sit and work and to actually um lock into what i want to do sometimes i'll create a plan in my um i'll create a plan in my content book that i have i went like this but i was trying to do quotations but I have a content book that I like to plan like my content in and like ideas that I have. It's so many ideas in there. Like I really need to like lock into stuff and just like really um, zone into what I really want to do. So um, like some videos that I want to shoot and um, I do want to do another affirmations video with you guys. I think that was really fun. I'm going to post or card my previous one if you're if you're new here. Hey boo, if you're new here. But I'm just going to card like my previous affirmations video. Um, but like I like stuff like that. I like that like vibe. I like that um, just that energy, putting that positive energy into the world. So um, it's just videos that I want to do. And I think that I, um, once I start thinking of it as a job and as something that I have to do, then it's a shift, you know, and I really appreciate that. So. I'm going to keep pushing to think of it as work, as a job, 
deadlines like that type of stuff if you don't have any self-discipline it's going to be really hard to really do this type of stuff and that's something that i'm working on every day like my self-discipline choosing to work instead of going to sleep you know what i'm saying like if it's a job then you need to like schedule in your hours and schedule in your breaks so um so i'm looking forward to the new year i really am because i do like i said i noticed a shift in myself just kind of like thinking of it differently so um i'm gonna head to sleep now i feel like i'm rambling a little bit but i kind of wanted to chat with you guys for a second and um i will see you guys tomorrow like i said i do have to work but i am gonna check back in with you guys once i'm off most likely and then we will go from there okay good night guys look at this robe i got from target it's like the short one um, they did have the longer one as well, but it was like $40 and I was like, I might as well just go with the short one. I do keep my heat on in my place. So it kind of was, I'm like blocking my face, but it was kind of like pointless for me to get the long one when I still can be comfortable in the short. They also had the little cloth ones, like the cotton ones that's not fluffy. But they were like the same price. So I was like, I might as well just get this one. But <laughs> I actually love it. It's like this kind of like a short sleeve. I think this is like a, did I get the medium large? Um, I'm not sure what size I got. But as you can see, it's kind of like, you know, it has like a little, it wraps basically. Like robes, you can probably get whatever size, but Target. <laughs> um, of course, I'm heating up leftovers, of course. Um, I don't really think I got to show you guys my, um, the yams. But they all beat up <laughs> y'all don't mind them they're like literally beat up but y'all get the point <laughs> honestly i really should have recorded everybody's response like everybody's like oh these good can i get some more like i should have recorded it because <laughs> i was stressing i was just telling y'all like i was so paranoid about how they were going to turn out and they ended up being good girl critiquing overly <laughs> Hey guys, it is Saturday and I'm over here trying to make a TikTok <laughs> and I've been kind of giddy about it because this is my first time trying to do like a transition and it doesn't seem that difficult this transition because I've been like sometimes I'll practice making TikToks like I won't really be dressed up but I want to see if I can get the motion and the turning your head and turning it back. If you've seen transitions on TikToks and you know what I'm talking about so I'm going to show you guys a TikTok that I'm going to try and recreate. I had this bonnet on for a reason. It's like a part of the look. So, yeah, I'm going to show you guys in a second. If I mute the sound, that's because I'm not sure if this song is copywritten or not. But I'm still going to show you guys, like, the the point in it. <laughs> I Like I said, I haven't created a transition yet. I want to have, like, this bonnet on first. And then when I turn around, I'm just going to have, like, my hair out when I go to turn around. So, let's try it. <laughs> okay so one thing i wasn't paying attention to was my foot my placement because when i go to change and i take my bonnet off i want to make sure i'm standing in the same exact spot that i was already in so okay i have a bag on the floor right here i'm gonna like mentally remember i'm lined up like with this bag let me see if i want to move this bag some because okay okay this is a good spot. Okay, so Morgan, you're next to the bag. <laughs> okay. Let me try again. Oh my god. <laughs> I know I look so dumb with y'all watching. I know I look so dumb. Huh. Huh. Okay, so the issue that I'm having now is my green shirt is out at the bottom. Like, I feel like I don't want it to be, like, peeking. So, I'm going to just, I'm going to give it a little tuck. <laughs> All right, maybe I need to move this closer. Move this up a little bit. Okay. All right. <laughs> Can y'all see me? Ah! Can y'all see me? Oh, my gosh. <sighs> okay, anyway. Okay, okay, let's try again. Fix the bonnet. Cause the, the point in this part for me, I guess I kind of look a mess. I kind of look a little rough. And then when I go to turn around, I'm going to look cute. <laughs> I'm not doing my makeup though. I ain't doing all of that. I'm, I am doing all that. Cause I ain't going nowhere today. Okay. Okay. Ah! You can 
sorry guys you can see my underwear <laughs> okay maybe i should put something on but you can't see the bottom but you can't see the bottom half of me like that's not the point in the video all right oops hot in here for that split second why do I feel like I'm too close all right I'm gonna figure this out and then once I move on y'all gonna see again <laughs> okay so I'm pretty much together I just threw on like this little sheer top but you know I'm just Doom, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm getting hot. All right. Oh, this is the cult that I told you guys that are from Meniere de Voix. <laughs> I think I had it in one of my, I think it was my previous vlog that I had this in. Um, but I was saying it was cropped and you can like go like that. Okay, this is that brand. But anyway, back to what I was doing. <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. Your girl's getting hot already. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I pop out like this. Rah! You see? <laughs> I wonder, like, where should I focus you guys? You guys want to actually, like, see me do it? Or you just want to see me do it? Alright. Okay. Okay, okay. Alright, so clearly I have to be turned around. How do I? All right, okay, so this is gonna be a trial and error part. I know the lighting is suckish. This is gonna be the trial and error part because I wanna see, I have to make sure I'm turning in the right direction. So right now I'm just gonna test it to make sure this fur is like, this is why I take it, this is why I take the hood off because the fur is just killing me. So it's gonna be like this. All right, did I turn the right way? So I went like this. Oh, I think I turned the wrong way. <laughs> okay, I think I turned the wrong way. Let me let me delete that one. So I think I'm supposed to. All right, okay. Key. This is a key. So this is what I'm gonna do with my feet, right? I'm gonna have my feet like this, so I can easily turn. Okay. <laughs> these are like I'm getting these. I get all these little TikTok trick hacks from the people, the younger generation that be on there doing the most. All right, so let me turn my key. Okay. Ah, it's kind of cute. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's so cute. Wait. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. 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 Wait. 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 Wait, because I may have turned a little bit too soon. Okay. Okay. That was cute. That was cute. <laughs> that was so cute, y'all. That was so cute. Oh. Okay, I actually do have to do that over because I forgot to put on lip gloss. And I turned just like a little bit too soon. Like you can't see my arms up. It doesn't like give that transition effect. So I'm gonna put some gloss on and then try again. Okay, I'm gonna try it again. So this way, I turned this way. Hands up, all right. <laughs> satisfied with that um if you uh, i saw this tiktok that was explaining like how do you figure out the best way um the best way to know what time is a good time to post a tiktok um and basically the time is going to be catered to you based off your subscriber not your subscribers based off your followers and all that good stuff so i can show you guys just in case you guys haven't seen the tiktok if you guys are on tiktok 
and you want to, you're interested in knowing like how to figure that out. So you have your TikTok page here and you will go over here to settings and you will go to creator tools. If you see creator tools here, creator, creator tools. And then you will go to analytics. And then this will take you to your actual data, all that good stuff. So then you will go over to followers. And then you kind of go down, you're able to see the gender that you mainly, you'll see the gender here that you mainly um, appear in, the state, and then the time here. Um, see, last week mine said 9 p.m. and now it's saying 8. So I would check this pretty consistently, like pretty much every time you're trying to post something, I probably would check it just to see what they're saying is the best time for you. So I'm going to post that at 8 o'clock. <laughs> it is now 2.57, so that's how I do that. Okay, so now I'm just kind of like looking through the pictures that I got from my family on Thanksgiving. Doll. A lot of these pictures I haven't seen yet of myself. You see I'm all chubby. <laughs> This was in 2007. I used to cheer, clearly. And some of them don't have years, but this one was a year I used to dance. So I'm just going to uh, fill my book up. I mentioned before in a couple vlogs ago that I wanted to, I wanted to have an actual photo book because I want something to, I want something tangible. I don't want it to all be on the phone. Like when I get a new phone, I was actually just mentioning this. When I get a new phone, I like to start from scratch I don't like to transfer over all of my pictures and stuff because it's like it's so much like I really love to start fresh so um, I'm gonna add this stuff to it I have some scissors here just in case I have to kind of cut a uh, extra side out or something so they can fit and everything but that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of my night thank you guys so much for tuning in as always I will I will see you guys in my next vlog um, stay tuned for Vlogmas that is coming up and my birthday is coming up too so I'm going to do a a trip vlog for that so yeah I'm excited <laughs> so I'll see you guys later and have a good day